trouble playing Call of Duty Warzone due to dev error 5573? If that's the case, there are several solutions you can try. Although this issue has been reported to occur mostly on PCs and PS4s, Xbox users should also get an idea on what to do if they happen to encounter the problem on their console. Solution number one, reboot your device. Sometimes, a simple reboot of the computer or console is all that's needed to get Warzone working again. Solution number two, check for game or software updates. It is recommended that you always use the most recent versions of your games, apps, and operating system, regardless of whether you play on a PC or console. It's a great method to keep potential issues at bay and solve any known bugs. If you want to play Warzone but can't because your version is too old, make sure that your other software and operating system are up to date. Solution number three, troubleshoot your internet connection. The stability and reliability of Warzone are both affected by the speed and stability of your internet connection. The game is technically playable with a 5 Mbps download speed. However, I strongly advise you to play at a much higher speed to avoid any potential issues with latency or bandwidth. Connecting your computer or console directly to the router via LAN cable might reduce the likelihood of being disconnected from a wireless network. Solution number four, rebuild the PS4 database. If you are experiencing dev error 5573 on PS4 while playing Warzone, one possible solution is to rebuild the console's database. Turn the PS4 off completely. Once the console is fully off, press and hold the power button on the PS4 front panel until you hear two beeps. Release the power button after the second beep, which should occur about 7 seconds after the first one. Connect your controller to the console using a USB cable, then press the PlayStation button. In the Safe Mode menu, Choose option 5, Rebuild Database. Solution number 5, Delete and Reinstall Warzone. In the event that none of the solutions above resolve the issue, you may try uninstalling and reinstalling Warzone. The size of the game's download file is the culprit here. It could be several hours before you can play the game again if your network is too slow. That's it! If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.